Hello guys, welcome to my channel Phil Slab How to Academy. Today we are gonna look at how to use the if function in Excel. Let's see first look at the formula for the if function. The sentence is like if you have you write you have to write a keyword if and then to use a parenthesis and the, and then you have to write the condition which you want to check it and then after you have to write a comma then you have to write a value and that value for that like if the condition is true then 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 this value will be returned and after a comma you have to write a value and that value return if the, the if the condition is false so this is syntax for if condition you can also like check multiple conditions so let's do a practical with that. You have to write a keyword if, then you add a parenthesis. After you have to write a logical test mean a condition which you want to check it. Let's say I want to check that shipping cost for my data like shipping cost cannot be must not be greater than the unit price. So this then check if the condition is true. You have to write the condition you have for you have to write a value which you want to get if the condition is true, then you have to write a value which I can when the condition is true or false. So the first write a value which you wanna get when the condition is true. If the condition is true, then I would say that it will be a loss because if the shipping cost is greater than the price, then it is a loss. So since it's a since it's a character, so in the character, so you have to write in a double quote. So now you have to write something for which you want to get when the condition is false. When the condition is false, like when the when the shipping cost is no greater than the unit price, then the, then I would say that it is a profit. So since I open our uh, parenthesis, so I have to close our parenthesis and press OK. You can see the profit because you can see there the shipping cost is 35 and the unit price 38 per 94 because the shipping cost is no greater than 38 per 94 condition is false. So that's why I get the profit. Now I can drag it and get a value for all. You can see how we can use the if condition. 